Is my garage gym nicer than Coop's from Garage Gym Reviews? Hell no. Hey guys, Steph here from Barbell Sanctuary. Uh, in today's video, I want to go over why my garage gym is grungy, messy, and the way it is, like it is. And I think that 90% of you with garage gyms, they might be cleaner looking, but why this is okay. This is my space. This is, I, I like the grunginess of it. If you watch Coop's channel, Garage Gym Reviews, excellent channel, excellent reviews on uh, garage gym equipment. And if you want to find out about buying new equipment, that's the place to go. But that's not what this channel is about. This channel is more about how you can slowly build your garage gym by doing things yourself, saving money, buying and selling used equipment. He concentrates on the new equipment purchases. And yes, I will sometimes buy some something new, but it's very rare. Uh, most of the stuff I've started to build. I'm even considering selling some of my equipment because I kind of figured out better ways to build some myself. What sparked the idea for this video? Last week's video was a, a tour of my garage gym and I had my first negative comment on the channel, which kind of made me laugh a little bit because he called me out as your garage gym is disgusting, looks like a junk filled, anyway, whatever. And that there's no way in hell that he would be caught working out in this gym because it's disgusting. And you know what? I replied to him and I said, thanks for watching, taking the time to comment uh, on my video. The great thing is, it's my garage gym and you don't have to work out in it. Nobody else has to put up with your stuff and you don't have to put up with other people's stuff. That's the great thing about having a garage gym. Also, you know, I mean, I don't think this is horror level, is it? No, I don't think it's that bad. Could be better. So in today's video, I'm gonna clean it up, stick around to the end, because once I get it cleaned up, I wanna put up a couple things I got for Christmas. My kids got me a little Baby Yoda poster. I wanna put that up. And my wife actually made me a custom sexy calendar. So I'll be putting that up and showcasing that at the end. So stick around for that. guys I did it I cleaned my gym so buddy would you work out in this gym now doesn't matter it's my gym so you can't but you know what it's my gym that's what I like I wouldn't want it all nice and like super clean it's not that it's dirty it's you know it's just grungy it's a garage gym I just want that atmosphere you guys know what I mean I just like the DIY projects and that's what my gym reflects. And you know what? I'll get the same results as somebody with the fancy equipment, I guarantee you. But you know what? It's a great start. We're in January. I have all year to pick around. Yes, I did shove some things here and there, kind of like my kids shove their stuff under their bed when we tell them to clean their rooms. My gym's clean. The moment you're all waiting for, here is the Baby Yoda poster. Okay, no, I'm just kidding. You guys want to see the sexy calendar that my wife custom made for me. Now, for those of you that know me, I'm an avid uh, lumberjack. I like cutting wood. It's always been a joke. Every time I, she comes to see me, we take a picture of her holding the chainsaw or whatnot. And we always joke that we'd make a, a calendar called Women of the Wood Pile. Well, lucky me, I received that particular calendar for Christmas. So here it is, January 2021, wait for it, bam, look at that. All right guys, so I know this is just basically a video of me cleaning my gym, but the point of the video is don't feel bad 
and I see this all the time in the Facebook groups. They're like, oh, this is my gym. This is all it is. That's not all it is. It's your space. It's your gym. Who cares what anybody else thinks? And you know what? I was going to clean my gym anyways. You're not the one who made me do it. Well, you know, it helped. It gave me an idea. When I saw that comment, I was like, you know what? I'm going to make a video about this. But I think it's perfect. It ties into my garage gym tour last week. And now at least I start the year off with a clean gym. If you have a garage gym or you plan on making a garage gym or a home gym this year, make sure you subscribe to my channel. Lots more DIY and garage gym related videos coming. Uh, one every week. And thanks for stopping by. Hit that like button. And we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Paul the little